how long did it take to put the suit on? I mean, at the beginning, six years ago, it took about 45 minutes to an hour. Um, but now it probably takes us between 10 to 15 minutes. Yeah, like we've really got it on lock. It, yeah. And also, the more and more you wear a suit, the easier and easier it becomes because the zips get easier. You know, it's always a sad day when I come to set and Anthony, my costumer, is like, we've got a new suit today. Oh, because it's we've like not to... broken in. Yeah, because like sometimes the fingers wear away and the elbows wear away. Mm. So when he says there's a new suit, I'm like, oh. oh yeah. I feel yeah. like us, everyone around you too has learned it too, because I always know what this means. Yeah, I sometimes <laughs> we'll be on set and they'll be like, we've got 15 minutes. I turn around, I'm like, help me get out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did you unzip me? <laughs> Have you ever been on set? Everything's set up, you're suited up. And you just get this sudden urge to go to the bathroom. Yeah, yeah how happens? Did you get to go? Did you just have to act through it? What, what, what happens? I mean, on the first film, I remember we did a sequence on the Washington Monument, and I had to climb up and down it for like weeks on end. Did and, your mom call? Yeah, and basically, I didn't go to the toilet for like 11 hours or something, and I was desperate. And when you wear the harness under the suit, obviously you can't put it over the top because you'll see it. No. And because the suit is so tight, you have to cinch the harness up from the get-go. So it, it means going to the bathroom is a mission. Yeah. And I remember I called my mum up and I was like, I've had a really hard day. Like, I would need to go to the toilet. I haven't been to the toilet for 11 hours, this and that, that and this. Two or three days later, the producers took me aside and they were like, how, how are your kidneys? And I was a bit like, what? <laughs> They're fine. I, I don't know. I've never really felt my kidneys before. <laughs> and they said, no, well, your mum's called us and told us to give you, like, adequate uh, That's toilet right, breaks. And I remember being mortified, but also so <laughs> grateful because I really needed to go to the bathroom <laughs> and I was too scared to, like, disrupt filming. That is professional, though. That's yeah. impressive. Now, they now I'm like, like, I'm doing this shit. <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> I gotta go. <laughs> We're in the middle of a take. Guys, yeah. no, guys. listen. Yeah. Hey. Um, Zendaya, this one's for you. Uh, you are amazingly multi-talented. Thank you. Um, obviously, in Spider-Man, we mainly get to see your <laughs> acting skills, uh, but you can also sing really well, and you're a really good dancer too. So the question is, do you have a favorite performing arts skill set, or do you just enjoy all of them equally? I think I love them all equally and for different reasons. I just focus on different ones at different times. Mm. But I think music is its own thing. You know, it gives something to my soul and my spirit that's different than mm -hmm. acting does. I think acting has really helped me um, become more, um, I guess, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm a very like guarded person, much like MJ is. And I think much like what Peter does for her, which is open her up a little bit, I think that's what acting has allowed me to do, is just kind of crack open my shell a little bit mm. and not be so um, self-critical and not be so, you know, I, I don't know, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a Virgo and I am very, you know, tough on myself. Um, and so I think sometimes with this job that we have, it allows you to kind of be like, well, you have to be a little bit silly. Like, you mm. have to, like, feel like you can't be afraid of looking stupid or like whatever or else you're not gonna do a good job um, and I think often especially on on our on our set you know sometimes it's just blue screens and we don't know what the hell we're supposed to be looking at <laughs> yeah. or what it's gonna turn into later so I was like yeah I might look crazy because right now I'm like ah, ah, yeah. ah, you know what I mean but it'll look cool later yeah. Yeah. but the only reason the only way you're it's gonna look cool is if you let go and you're just like all right yeah, you do have to just give up and be like, do you know what? I'm sure at some point this will look cool. <laughs> yeah. I know I look like an absolute donut now, but... Speaking of looking like an absolute donut, I do it all the time, every day. <laughs> yeah, we all do. <laughs> Don't worry, mate. I make videos <laughs> like you guys. You just have to imagine stuff there. Speaking of which, I've got to show you a video. So Please, on, show me. On TikTok, you know how you can do hashtags? If you put in hashtag Spider-Man, it's like thousands. Yeah. <laughs> sure. I found this out yesterday. I've actually got the number one video on the hashtag Spider-Man on TikTok. Do you? Oh, yeah. Let's have a look then. I really want to show you. I thought it would be so cool to show the actual Spider-Man. Please, Spider let's have a look, mate. Yeah. My Spider-Man video. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> No, but me also. Yeah. <laughs> me still. That's a good pose. Oh. How did you just do that? Now you were putting a lot of faith in oh, that tap. Look, look at that toe. Toe is gripping for dear life. I would not be doing that. That's excellent work. 